please give a warm welcome for Charlie Bolden. All right, all right, all right. How you doing? More than 250 right. students joined with here, astronaut right? Leland Melvin and Administrator Charles try. Bolden at the but Jet Propulsion here. Laboratory to, to help kick off NASA's Summer of Innovation. Okay. What we want to do this summer through the Summer of Innovation is take young men and women like Malik, and we want to help them understand. Yes, science and math may be difficult, but you can learn it. The education initiative will use the excitement and inspiration of NASA missions to engage thousands of middle school students and teachers nationwide in stimulating math and science-based programs during the summer months, a time when learning skills often decline. So in the summertime, we really have to think about how are we being active with our brains and our bodies? We have to keep moving and keep learning. These youngsters, many of them from minority and low-income households, rubbed elbows with other astronauts, engineers, and scientists. But we did study hard. We uh, stayed in school. And I encourage you to find something that you love and to pursue it with all of your hearts. They also participated in interactive and educational activities, including a visit with the next Mars rover Curiosity, scheduled to launch in 2011. How many girls here think robotics is cool? Lots of you. How many of you girls think that you could do robotics just as well as any of the boys in this room? Oh, that's what I like to see. Getting that robot down off that lander, I did that. I told that robot how to get up there, and I told it how to get back down. Uh, yeah, thank you very much. The Summer of Innovation includes summer learning programs managed by each of NASA's 10 centers, the incorporation of NASA materials into existing non-NASA summer school curricula, and partnering with other federal agencies to promote education in science, technology, engineering, and math. And you don't have to be an astronaut to do cool things for NASA. If you're good at computers or building things, you've got the right stuff.